A body was found after fire crews extinguished a house fire in downtown Hilo this morning. Nikki Shenfeld spoke with witnesses and has more in tonight's top story. One witness says she heard a loud sound around 9:40 this morning. I could hear like two loud noises. I thought my neighbors dropped something, and then my mom heard from my neighbor that there's a fire. So. Like I ran outside and to see, and then there's this big cloud of smoke. Fire officials saying the fire started behind a two-story plantation home off Kina Ole Street. When they arrived, the area was fully involved. Coming out of BJ Penn, and I hadn't gone about three feet before everybody was looking, stopping their cars. And what I did was I looked to the right, down the street, and there was the fire. Burke tells me fire crews were quick to respond. The fire station just feet away from the burning home. By the time the uh, fire department was putting water on it, there, the flames were really going. Smoke was billowing in the air, you know, thick as anything. Everybody around me was saying, oh my goodness, is this going to catch fire to the other buildings? Because it was really intense, really fast. The fire was brought under control just 40 minutes later. Bystanders worried the blaze would affect nearby structures. It's not a residential as such, you know, with grass and, you know, everything. The houses are right more or less on top of each other, all, going all the way down the street. The burning home was in such bad shape, the crews couldn't do an immediate search. But once the fire was extinguished, they found a body inside. The victim has not yet been identified. Officials say fire crews were able to make a defensive attack to save other homes just 20 feet away. Those suffered moderate damage. The cause of the fire is still under investigation. Damage to the home is $525,000. Nikki Schenfeld, KHON2 News.